President of the Interim Regional Administration of Tigray Getacho Reda and Vice President of the Interim Administration Lieutenant General Tadesa Wereda discussed on the next movements of the DDR process with representatives of the National Rehabilitation Commission. In a media briefing yesterday, Getacho Reda said that they have discussed on matters that would help to fully facilitate the DDR process. Disarmament, demobilization and reintegration We've made progresses to achieve the disarmament, demobilization and reintegration program so far. We're also currently working on disarmament of heavy weaponers and registering what we have started and accomplished, including the handing over of heavy weaponers in different military camps, especially to hand over the group weaponers in a short period of time in order to achieve the demobilization and reintegration program fully. We'll work on solving the challenge in the DDR process, mobilization of resources and working on development activities together. The president also noted that the interim government is doubling efforts to rehabilitate and help personnel who joined the army from public and private sectors to return back to normalcy and restart engaging to their previous activities. <laughs> The interim regional administration is already formulated. The returning of civil servants who join the army is very mandatory. We understand the responsibility of the process of the rehabilitating demobilized personnel when they return back to the society is tremendous. Hence, we will work closely with the federal government and other international organizations to carry on the progresses we have started. Commissioner of the National Rehabilitation Commission, Tashoma Toga, on his part said that they had successfully discussed with Interim Regional Administration and acknowledged the commitment shown by the Interim Administration of Tigray in the process. We have discussed focusing on what tasks are left to fully engage the DDR program to the ground and it was good and successful. The first precondition to the DDR process is disarmament, hence we have agreed that it should be accomplished in a very short period of time, especially the handing over of group weaponers, taking into account what have been accomplished so far. Achieving this, the demobilization process is the next step. The demobilization process includes tasks such as sheltering, camping, and registering. So we discussed it with the regional officials who are responsible to work with the commission on how to work closely to organize the tasks together. We're also working to open a branch here in Marla. Generally, we made a good agreement in such matters. Vice President of the National Rehabilitation Commission, Brigadier General Derubia Disu, assured that the regional administration has handed over heavy weaponers to the national defense according to the peace deal. Uh, the regional administration handed over heavy weaponers and air force equipments to the National Defense Force based on the peace deal, which are not mentioned by the media. The next follows the handing over of group weaponers, which are related with the registration of all the personnel and demobilization process. Based on our yesterday's discussion, we have agreed to do the handing over of the group weaponers next. President Ketacho Reda also noted that the interim government is working with the federal government to avoid previous mistakes occurred in such juncture. We have not observed a good experience regarding demobilization and reintegration in previous activities. We are working on to plan and evaluate together with the federal government. Not repeat the mistakes made in 1991 and after the end of the Eritrea war in such process. And I think we'll do a better job this time.